Well, we've already started down the road. Look, welcome back. We are in the duck call room. For those of you that caught it last week, how did y'all like our first Tuesday episode? Because this is the second one. We're, we're, we're back running another Tuesday episode. If you're watching this on YouTube, make sure you've subscribed to the new Duck Call Room YouTube channel at youtube.com slash duck call room. Soon, new episodes of the Duck Call Room podcast won't be posted on the main Duck Commander channel anymore. The only place you'll be able to watch them is on the new Duck Call Room channel. So head on over to youtube.com slash duck call room. That's one word, duck call room, and subscribe. And hit the notification bell so you don't miss an episode. Also remember to uh, give us a little friendly review rating on your podcast apps. That way all your friends can find us. We've done all the housekeeping. Now let's get started. Si? Yes. What did you think of that weather yesterday? How about hey, that? Look, 2020 was bad. Okay. 2021 ain't doing no better. Okay. But, hey, have y'all looked at the forest? No, I look at the trees. Well, I know. Hey, well, <laughs> hey, have you, you have been noticing it? Hey, there's it's, dead trees everywhere. Blown down. Oh, yeah. Rotted out, whatever. So we had some really bad weather yeah. the last couple of days. Oh, yeah. yeah. Look, Tuesday I was fishing. Tuesday afternoon I was fishing, and I turned around and looked. Oh, you seen it coming? Well, I turned around and looked, and I said, "Huh, that don't look real good." And then you hear that that far off, just a little rumble. I said, "Yeah, God's okay. bowling. God and angels are bowling." <laughs> yeah, Amen. Yeah. So I, I I looked and I told my buddy, I said, "We probably ought to start heading back to that boathouse right about now." Oh yeah. And we got back over, and when we got over and put the boat on the lift. I looked up and the sky was like fluorescent green. I told him, I said, I've only seen this one other time. I said, and it wasn't good. I, and then that mess come and it was like just a little trickle. I was like, oh, this ain't too bad. But we got in my truck. <laughs> and then that rascal, it went from okay to I can't see like the end of my truck. Oh, yeah. And then my whole truck started shaking because the wind got to going about 55. And I said, we got to get out of here. And I just, I guess I was playing Twister or something. I just floored it straight. I said, we got to get off top yeah. of this hill. We was on the levee of the pond. I oh, said, yeah. we're going to end up in that mm. pond. Oh, so, yeah. oh, something yeah. goes bad. So we pulled down, and I got video of it. But, like, quarter-sized hail just beat the snot out of us. That's why I figured out why they call it hail, because it certainly ain't heaven. Hey, that monsoon season in Vietnam, <laughs> you boys ain't hadn't seen no rain. So it's like Forrest Gump said. It's sideways rain, oh, no, upside no, no, down no, no. Hey, rain. Hey, and it's so crazy. It may only rain for like 15 minutes, but when it comes down, okay, I'm talking about, you know, I'm looking at five guys running, okay, toward shelter. <laughs> it starts. Them five guys disappear. And look, they're here to the wall over to me. You know, I stuck my arm out. Like this, out under the porch. Don't, I mean, hey, don't, don't say it. It looked, it looked like I did. No, no, it looked like I had not my arm amputated. <laughs> you can't see it. I'm serious. You can't. You talking about can only rain? See hey, <laughs> he's, you talking about He's like rain. a magician. <laughs> no, 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 yeah, no, no. I did one of going. <laughs> Well, Johnny D, nice of you to join us. Now you want you got anything to add to this? Now that you finished you lunch, I mean, no, I showed up and there was there was French fries in my chair, so I had to eat them. You can't pass those. <laughs> Did up. you just? That's all that crunching I was hearing. Yeah, he's just sitting there eating his curly Did fries. I, well, I had it on me. I thought the angels were bowling again. Yeah. Uh, no, you was uh, that your lunch? You don't like that French was fries? Half of my lunch. And you just thanks. I ate the Arby sandwich. Oh, but he pitched for Arby. <laughs> free. Let me tell you uh, something. Free. You can send me some mailbox money. They got some free. They got <laughs> the meats and the fries. Oh, so JD cleaned the fries. Up We've got. The I cleaned meats. that up good. No, I didn't even know it rained like the last few days. Do what? I didn't even know. Like you're talking about, but because I, I was in this dungeon of an office that we oh, have. Oh yeah, we don't have any windows. Don't we don't have. have windows. I don't have any windows. I was just in here, and then everybody's like, "Oh no!" My wife was like, "Text me. Do I need to take shelter?" I said, "From what?" Nah, you be alright. <laughs> And then yeah. I looked and I said, oh, there's a tornado warning. I said, yeah, I guess. So. Yeah, that's yeah. what's crazy is Tuesday, like, when we were fishing, we weren't even in any kind of warning at all. And I got scared for my life. Yesterday, we had tornado warnings all around us. And I was like, this this ain't nothing but rain. Like, this ain't, this ain't no big deal. Like, well, hey, you know I never they got people, you know? 
that chase them things? Yeah, I ain't one of them. Hmm. Yeah. It seems to like chase me movie? though. That's what yeah. that's what I don't understand. Hey, what do you do for a living, son? Huh? I chase tornadoes. <laughs> well, have you ever caught one and rode it? <laughs> <laughs> what did they say to that? <laughs> Tell me. <laughs> Tell and me. I said, Tell me. no. It's a pretty good gig because they only work about three months out of the year. Plus, okay. I mean, Si, you'd probably do it. I mean, no. I've, I've seen you do way worse. No, he'd do it. No. He's an adrenaline junkie. He he'd is. do it in a heartbeat. He won't admit it, but he is. But the problem is they don't want to get like right up in it. So I'd be like, no, drive that thing up in there, yeah. son. No, get up on like, in there. We ain't going to get this close. It, yeah. Let's chase now, it. Hey, that would be a story to tell. <laughs> Oh, I, if I'm he's surprised going out, it ain't happened to no, you No, no, yet. no, no. I drive my pickup truck camouflage mm -hmm. into the tornado world. I don't, I don't recommend Where that. would I, I end up? I, That's the question. I don't know. Would it lift it up and take it away? That's probably I how you'd, you'd go out. I think you'd end up in heaven. Yeah, I'm hey. going to heaven. <laughs> I, I, I'm going with heaven. Rolling with the angels drive again. Hey, Elijah done into that. Into a yeah. tornado. Yeah. All right, I'm out. Hey. That's right. Y'all about the same age. <laughs> that would be a cool ride. Uh, he didn't even final hear you. ride. He didn't even hear your old joker. Yeah. So. Well, hey, look, I was thinking about going to heaven, boys. Hey, <laughs> in a tornado. That'd okay. be that'd be quite the entrance, wouldn't it? Oh, what are you talking about? Mm -hmm. Hey, it wouldn't be. Hey, Saint Peter, can I come in? It'd, <laughs> I'm done. I'm in. So you think? It, so when you hear that, you think them angels and everybody's up there bowling. What if they just duck on? What if they just now, got I into a bum, 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 I thought bum, it was bowling. Yeah. Okay, because it sounds like it sounds just like sometimes the a ball hitting the pins. Yeah. <laughs> sound effects by Phil. <laughs> Thank you. I was looking around. I, 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 I didn't know we had a soundboard. <laughs> and Goblin's not here. Well, see, there's so many things we don't know about that. I mean, seriously. Like what? If huh? there's gonna be duck hunting in heaven? Well, no, no, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, Phil, better. Phil thinks there is, and and the good thing is, okay, there will be no limit. I know what's okay? coming. And next. then there will not be <laughs> any game wardens. Oh boy, because <laughs> you're not making it. <laughs> <laughs> Rude. You knew that was coming. Yeah, I knew it was coming. <laughs> hey, I we all hey, look. We all say it in all of our speeches. I mean, it's like ducks, deer everywhere you look, and That's there right. ain't a game warden in sight. <laughs> and look, every one of them. Gets a laugh. <laughs> well, I did, I'd never heard the because they didn't make it there. Right. No, right. yeah, I, I say it a little bit differently. Yeah, that's I, not nice. You I, have to think I, about it to get it. Well, I in. throw back to you know the old ways gone, and we're in a new way. So you know we're like, yeah, let's. The I, old I is gone. The new the, is come. Yeah, yeah. so I, I'm throwing right. out the old laws. We get up there, you know. Everything is new, boys. But yeah. let me tell you something. If a game warden does make it up there. He's a good fella, so I, yeah. I trust that he can still do his job up there if that's what he's assigned to do, you know? So that's, <laughs> it is what it is. You You're know? a nice person. Yeah. I am a nice person, okay. and just in case yeah. any game wars listening to this, I want him on my side. <laughs> and he follows the rules. And that's I the, do follow the that's rules. That's the difference here. Like, when we talk about old stories, you, you're still, like, looking over your shoulder for game wardens from when you were, like, 19. Martin doesn't have that problem. Oh, no. I try about 14. <laughs> <laughs> I, wasn't, I wasn't that old, J.D., yeah. when, I, so, when I went to, uh, on the wrong path, so to speak. <laughs> but he got it turned around by 42, so yeah. it's all good. Once he started getting uh, that senior citizen uh, license for $5, uh, that's whenever he turned it around. Well, they figure we're not dangerous. But, yeah. hey, that is a... Uh, True statement. Uh, no, oh, that is an assumption on their part, which is incorrect. Oh, my goodness. Well, <laughs> size middle name is danger. And that sounds like a good time to take our first break. We'll be back with we'll Danger right Side, back. baby. Yeah, so you, look, hey, look at them. They're cool. Well, I, th I think, I think yeah. they got American flags on them. So, Sire, si, are you busy checking out our, our latest uh, sponsors of the podcast? What are you looking at over there? Some holsters? Some gun holsters. Yeah, our friends over at We the People Holsters have. Oh, uh, We the People. We the People. Where does where does We the People come from, Sire? Si? Hey, come from the Constitution. There you go. I like that. Right, well, so, hey, look, yeah. guys, if you're out there looking for some awesome holsters and other gun accessories, you have to check out We the People Holsters. They start at just 40 bucks, and they're custom molded to fit your exact firearm for a quick, smooth draw. They have thousands of options to choose from, including an amazing selection of printed holsters, even ones with our buddies over at Realtree. So they got the Realtree camouflage on them. 
Their proprietary clip design allows you to easily adjust both the cant and ride of your holster so it's comfortable and secure at all times. Si, for you, that means they can adjust how it fits. Well, hey, yeah, we, I, I don't want to have to define cant and ride for you for I, a holster. I so. will get with them. So, look, go to wethepeopleholsters.com slash duck, and while you're there, check out their line of premium printed hoodies, long sleeve shirts, hoodies. and their new EDC hoodies. tactical gun belt. Which comes paired with a patented Cobra buckle. Every holster and gun belt comes with a lifetime guarantee. If it's not a perfect fit, send it back, get a full refund. All you have to do is go to wethepeopleholsters.com slash duck. You can get an additional $10 off with the offer code duck. That's wethepeopleholsters.com slash duck. Wethepeopleholsters.com slash duck. I, I like them guns you had in that picture. You didn't see the picture on the... <laughs> yeah, because he saw his Instagram. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what, what these, oh, si, that was a no. great photo you posted. These two? No, I took a picture of you when we were in... Uh, I'll show it to him. Yes, yeah, just show it show to him. him. Instagram.com. Because at one time I had four on me. Oh, no, this is a different one. I didn't one. have scabbard. No, this is a different one. This is right. a different right. one. This is when you drove the tank. Well, Si, what kind of I tank have was good it? news for you. Oh. Because today's first ad read is a company called We the People Holsters. Okay, well, the oh, people holsters. by the way, I went to their website and they have got some awesome holsters. This I, one, I bet they can make one with size face on it. We'll talk about that in the ad read though. But yeah, no, I know. Hey, I'm gonna tell you about. That is one bad dude right there. Ladies and gentlemen, for y'all that didn't know, Cy si just discovered his Instagram. We're right? looking at. Si. Hey, that's what we need to do. Look, hey. Cy, si, did you know you had an Instagram? I don't even know what Instagram is. Can you, you spell Instagram? No. Insta- Insta- <laughs> no. Can you, can you no. use Instagram in a sentence? <laughs> yeah. Come on. Do it. Well, right. JD just said, I. Do you know you have an Instagram? Good job, hey, Sai. Very Winner. nice. Hey, Winner. We'll take it. At Sai Robertson. Look, you're wearing 14 different types of real tree. I'm not even sure how many shirts you're wearing. And you got two pistols just tucked down in your pants. Well, I had one picture. Okay. I guess nobody took a picture of it. I had four on. I look like Jonesy Wells. I had two Jonesy. up here. That's Josie's cousin. <laughs> yeah, the here. Outlaw. Good old Jonesy. <laughs> here and here. Okay. Here, here, <laughs> here. <laughs> old Jonesy Wells. Old Josie Wells, boy. Oh, now he's back on the other side <laughs> of the family. Well, 9,586 people enjoyed that photo enough well, to hit like. There you go. I wasn't one of them, so I'm going to make it 87. That movie had the most one good one-liners there are. What's your favorite one-liner from Josie Wells? Pick one. I like the one where the guy was selling some kind of a, he was a. Elixir. Elixir. Yeah. The magic and, elixir. And old jo- Josie Wells everything. said, <laughs> he said, how is it on stains? <laughs> <laughs> I, I got a cup. I got a couple in there. I like. I like old Chief Dan George when he, he dropped the, this is a piece of hard rock candy. It ain't for eating. It's for looking through. Yeah. Right? <laughs> and then I like when old granny said, I ain't ever been much on them Jayhawkers neither. <laughs> <laughs> I go like ahead, Go ahead and shoot them, hey, Josie. Uh, <laughs> I like this one short line that says, shut up, Lodge. <laughs> shut up, Lodge. Uh, hey, we I got see, reward money coming. I've seen him do some things, Lodge. <laughs> Look up under that there blanket. Uh, <laughs> Look under go that through. there blanket. <laughs> We got us the Josie Well guy. We can go through the whole movie. Hey, we this. need to have Al here. He's the best at that. Oh yep. man, I don't yeah. want to. I mean, if we're gonna go through the whole movie, I just didn't watch it. But hey, hey. I, I still haven't watched it. So, oh uh, yeah, you need to be fired. You don't. Hey, I you watched need, the. I watched. Hey, I need to have my pistol and do what Matt Dillon does all the time. Yeah, we've got it on DVD for crying out loud. I don't around. think I own a DVD player, but um, I did watch like the first hour of Hang 'Em High the other night. It's a pretty that, good show. That's, that's a good one. It's, it's not Sorry. great. It's just good. Yeah, I mean, it ain't bad. It was one. free. Yeah. Eh. What'd you do? Order Domino's? Was it like on that free stuff? Where no, you, it was just uh, on the TV. Oh, I got you. I was cool. like, I'll, I'll try this. That way I can talk about right. it. Since we're talking about that, then I what got do y'all think about the movie Forgiven? Forgiven? Yeah. Clint Eastwood uh, directed. It's just all right. I better it ain't, it ain't much. Too. So it ain't much. Forgiven it's, it's all right. or unforgiven? Unforgiven is what he's talking oh, about. Oh, unforgiven. unforgiven. Yeah. Oh, I thought it was forgiven. Oh, okay. I was like. Those uh, are. What for, are you talking about? Forgiven, I'm out. I mean, I just, I don't have an opinion because I haven't seen it. Unforgiven, it's all right. I mean, it's not. It's just. It's, it's middle okay. of the road. <sighs> it's like when I make your tea and you say, I say, size is it good? And you say, it ain't it much. It ain't much. But, yeah. 
It's got a 96% and they say on that's Rotten Tomatoes. Was his best work. Really? Yeah. I don't understand. I'll tell you what Eastwood movie I really liked was The Mule. Did you watch that one? That one was solid. I didn't watch that one. Oh, man. That's oh, a good with one. Sister Sarah? No, no, that's two mules for oh. Sister Sarah. This one was just simply the oh, mule. Yes. I, I, of course, this one was made in the 2000s and not in the 1900s, say, so you I probably haven't, haven't seen it. I haven't it, even so. seen it. Oh, yeah. The you mule. The mule. When you said mules, I was thinking. The mule. Two Morgan mules Freeman's in Sarah. this? In the mule? No, he's in the Unforgiven. Unforgiven, yeah. I was about to say. I was in three the when oh, Unforgiven no, came the out. The critic said that was his best work. That's what I'm reading. I disagree. Yeah, I mean, but, was, but that's because yeah. he was a director? Yeah, maybe it was his best work as director. He was in it. Oh, yeah, yeah, he, yeah, was, yeah, in he it. was in it. So, I, what about Heartbreak Ridge? You remember that one? Oh yeah, yeah, that was all right. It was all right, I pretty have good. No clue what we're talking. That was about. a good, but Unforgiven, no, nah. not much. Well, since we've gone down this trail, what is everybody's favorite? You so you're about? you're Blues Brothers. I like that's the your, Blues Brothers. That's your yeah. favorite. Yeah. All right. yeah. Si, what's your favorite? I had to movie? go with him. What? Since he brought it. I'm serious. Si loves the music in, in yeah, the show for sure. I give him that. Yeah. yeah. But I, they're on a mission from God. I mean, come on. Right, yeah. yeah. Hey, I'm with you. Look, yeah. I was just, I figured Si, I figured with Si, it had to be a Western, really, to be his favorite. So that's uh, well, I, I, I haven't that. seen Blues Brothers either. Oh, my God. JD. Wait, I don't hey, watch a lot of movies. Where on. have you been si, under a rock? Si, slap him for me. I'll pay oh. you back later. <laughs> <laughs> also, Nine years before I was born. Yeah. Just throwing that out there. but yeah. You haven't seen the Blues Brothers? Well, if you wait a year or so, there'll be a remake of it, because that's it's all they're doing yeah. now is remaking oh. the old Is it, a, well, hey, is no, it a musical? There ain't no originality anymore. Yeah. Nope. Blues, it says it's a musical comedy. Yeah, it's, it's good. It's good. Oh, story. no. Who uh, who the two guys are starring? Belushi and... Uh, Dan Aykroyd. Yeah. Aykroyd. Yeah. Aykroyd. Yeah. Si, you remember when they, when they were sitting in the, in the cop car, and, and they're fixing the head out, and they have their... It's late. They got to have a full... A half, no, a full tank of gas. They're wearing sunglasses, and they got a half pack of cigarettes. <laughs> Hit it. <laughs> <laughs> they call it run, baby. Oh, wait, that's what you like. <laughs> hey, I'm telling you. Uh, Johnny the D, the what? chase scene was excellent in that. Though. They're <laughs> weaving in between them poles underneath. The, Stacking up the, cars. Yeah. In the cop cars, I mean, they must have wrecked a thousand cars but in I that will, movie. I will say this. Watch it on TV, because if you watch it, you know, where it's, you want to see the television edited version for sure. Yeah, there was some strong language. Yeah, it had yeah. some colorful yeah. language in it. Yeah. hundred uh, percent. I would say the T V version. Yeah, for yeah I gotta sure. get me in trouble. So yeah, you had to wait wait till the kids go to bed <laughs> if you watch the full length. Sure. <laughs> I'm not uh, advising that though. Well uh, my uh, T V uh, edited. Look, uh, that uh, one said musical comedy. I'll find out later. But I'm I'm gonna stick with the genre. Because right. Oh Brother Where Art Thou that's is easily that is a good that's probably good. the greatest movie no, ever no. made. And Golly, look, that's good. The star Cairo. didn't make it. It huh? was the, the uh, what do they call him? What? The music? Governor? No. no. In the jailhouse. No. The supporting the cast. Oh, yeah. Now. Yeah, the supporting cast, the two guys. Okay. No, they in the jailhouse now movie. in the tune of E, yeah. boys. Yeah, in the <laughs> tune of E. That's the soggy bottom boy. Oh, no. Right. Hey, we thought you was a goat. That guy's the best <laughs> one. Hey, so yeah. let me tell you a story. So when Sal was down and out and we thought he was going to die. <laughs> I mean, we're back. We, now. we can laugh at that. Now we can laugh. <laughs> I mean, that was a very aggressive way to say it, is why I laugh. But now we hey, can laugh at that. I've never seen, you know, I've never seen this side of Jay Stone where he came in and he looked at me and he said, Philip, we got to do anything we can to get him going. <laughs> and I was already moved in with him. I was like, uh, yeah, I'm with you, you yeah. know. Yeah. I'm I'm te- I was here. texting I'm you here. boys saying, yeah. Help, what do we need to do? Help me. Help. Anyway, Jay says, um, he said, whatever we got to do. And so we got my son over to play the guitar. And then we played out the Saggy Bottom Boys song for Sai. And me and Stone got and did a dance for both, him. Both <laughs> of and Stone hey, was dancing I wish, and singing. I, wish I had that on film. Uh, that so, happened? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Anyway, uh, oh, yeah he was, and so hey, was blown away. Stone's got more in him than you think, boys. Oh, yeah. hey. It was great. Can, yeah. I, yeah. I kind of want to get yeah. sick just so y'all oh, can no, do that hey. for me because that's. No, Stone I, was dead. By the way, folks. Let me tell you, hey, Stone, ain't Stone and house. Philip McMillan were my guardian angels during the virus. Hey, I agree. I just want really to see. Was. Stone I know dance. they were because they were the only ones that can get you to do anything. Well, you hard headed rascal. Well, hey, Stone just said, "Hey, old man, <laughs> get some clothes on because you're going to the hospital." And I said, "Stone, the last thing I want to do is get dressed and go anywhere." And he said, "Hey, 
I'm fixing to throw you over my shoulder and you're going naked, boy. <laughs> well, you get some clothes on. There you go. That was that was true. That's that, true story. That's a true oh, yeah. story. I, we need to remake that then. We need to have that happen. Hey. You can be the governor. Hey, oh no, look, Stone and Happy him Daniel. and McMillan can do the Soggy Bottom Boys <laughs> dance. I Let need me tell you. The Soggy Bottom Boys is also hey. the greatest they're band. The bad. Oh no, they're the bad. They're yeah, bad. They're bad to their bone. Martin? My favorite, favorite uh, movie. Man. I don't think you're gonna beat a brother art though. That's it's solid one. Yeah. It, it's in my top that's, that's five. I mean, it's always hard for me to choose one because there's like yeah. five that come on that I never pass up. Well, I think that you have to. You have to. Shawshank Redemption. Is, oh yeah, I've, you got to. You got to put what genre is? The, is that it? Yeah. yeah, the right word. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know, what genre are we in? Okay. Was, Willie had us all like trying to make our top ten movies for a while, and he's like, "No, you can't do it." And he was kind of right because yeah. once you got to nine, it was like, "Uh oh." Really? Once I you get throw to, this one out. Well, once you get to really like six or seven, you start looking at the list you have remaining to fill out ten. You're like, "No, nah, I can't do it. I can't. I can't choose three from these next thirty. See, I would just think say because I hate to be. A, I'd hate to be a judge. Yeah. Yeah, that's terrible. Yeah. Jurassic I mean, Park. That's a, that's a rough job. Jurassic Park. That's in there. All yeah. of them. It's really <laughs> I mean, a rough job being a judge because you're saying, God, there's so many good ones. But I'm a huge fan of the Batman movies, too. Like the old that's original ones. I love them. Yeah, they're fantastic. Like, I, I don't know. I'm yeah, that's weird. a, young, that's a I younger like, person. I like yeah. the TV. A younger person. The TV. John, I don't. You don't know how Batman? Boom. <laughs> yeah. All the. All Quick, the deal Robin, deal. throw me the shark repellent. With, yeah, with the old. <laughs> With the old Adam West in it, yeah, that that stuff was good, man. That Ah. makes me laugh. He goes, throw me the shark repellent, and then he like sprays him with hairspray. Yeah, and the shark falls off the helicopter. Of course, I would probably love that. It's the greatest. It's Batman. It's your age, Batman, and it's the greatest thing that ever happened. The Cape Crusader. Uh oh. Chips. Skip. Is it Skip the artist? Yeah, Skip Cooper. Okay, yeah. Skippy Coo. Him and Phil were in the woods in the four wheeler. Okay. And the woods were Phil. <laughs> yeah, and the mosquitoes are out. Okay, and he's got some. Uh, God, what's that? Uh, the perfume. Deet. Bath and Body Works. No. Uh, Victoria's Secret. Victoria's Secret. Oh bing, bing, yeah, that stuff works. No, it's a family show. Hey, no, that stuff Skip, works. No, no, Skip's got a bottle of of. Uh, Victoria's Secret. Victoria's Secret. Amber Romance. Yeah. Yep. And he there's he, a bottle of it in my truck. Oh yep. no no yep. no! Look, yep. it works. There, the mosquitoes are eating Phil alive, yep. and Skip sitting right beside him, and they ain't bothering him. Phil said, "Wait a minute, something ain't right here." And he said, "What are you talking about?" He said, "They're eating me alive. I mean, I've got fifty thousand on my hand." And he said, "You ain't none of them." But he said, "Hey, Victoria's Secret, uh, perfume." That may, Phil, that may be the secret. No, no. I'm saying, and Phil said, no, I ain't putting on a stupid perfume. You know, well, hey, about five minutes later, I was about to fly away with him. He said, hey, hand me a perfume. Yeah. <laughs> Victoria's <laughs> Secret it Pro is, Tip. It is a, a mosquito repellent. Let me give y'all a pro tip. Victoria's Secret Amber Romance. Buy it by the gallon jug. <laughs> but tell your woman before you use it. Yes, it is very strange when you come yeah, home and you've in the been wood, at the Don't camp go in the woods and put it on and then come back home. Hello, darling. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh-oh. Where what been? in the world? A, a, how did we get here? I don't well, <laughs> no, how no, do, we, how do gets, we get anywhere? You know what well, hey, I like? Oh, brother, where are that? That reminds me. Uh, Have you ever worn Victoria's <laughs> Secret perfume? <laughs> well, hey. It's a great mosquito Here's repellent. another one, okay? Uh, what, what's I this? don't even know who will use it, but Fabrice. Fabrice, yeah, Fabrio. Is this a tip? No, yeah. this is a deer hunting technique. Okay, we're now. Okay, in the- so look, <laughs> yo, Tip time this reasons. guy he uses Febreze, and I think it's spring. Springtime is the name of it. Look, nope. check it, He Johnny. gets out of his pickup truck, sprays it on the bottom of his feet, and walks to his stand. Deer will literally understand. So Fab- Phil, Fabrice. Phil, you know, this guy kills a buck every time he goes down there on the property. So Phil puts it on, and he goes and climbs up his stand, and he's sitting there, and he's watching three bandits come walking his way. Bandits? Okay, y'all Raccoons. Know bandits? Raccoons. Raccoons. <laughs> I thought you were talking about Three this. bandits, and every Game once in a while, they'll stop and go stand up on their hind legs and go, <laughs> and here they come again. Yeah. Here they come again. They actually climb the tree he's in that he tied his ladder to. 
from the Fabry's. Try, going, they're trying to no, get in the Fabry. Hey, look, they're on the last rung of the ladder, and then they stand up and go, and they're looking at him. <laughs> well, what do you do they, if they get to your boot? Hey, kick them. You do no, you do like I do. That's why I have a twenty uh, twenty two pistol on my. Blow him off the, the oh, last man. rung of the ladder. And boys. on that note, <laughs> yes, we need a break because hey, we, we need a break. After this, more random right. tips. We more. Not. We need a break because if we were on the Oregon Trail, we just got off and got dysentery or something. So we'll be back right after this. Pew, right. Pew, pew. Si, when you came in today, did you did you see the note on the by the time clock? You got to go report to the HR department. Hey, number one, I don't even know where the uh, uh, time clock is. JD. Number two, what does HR stand for? Huh? What does HR stand for? It stands for human resources. But look, I'm just kidding. I'm not in charge of human resources. But when you're running a small business, HR issues can absolutely kill you. You could run into wrongful termination suits, minimum wage requirements, labor regulations, and so many more. And the problem is HR personnel aren't cheap, are they, Phil? They're not. Very expensive. They have an average salary of $70,000 a year. So... Bambi, spelled B-A-M-B-E-E, was created specifically for with the small business in mind. For just oh, <clears throat> for just $99 a month, you can have your own HR department via Bambi. $99 a month times 12, much cheaper than $70,000 a year. So there's it's month to month. You can cancel any time. There's no hidden fees. All you have to do today is we're going to we're going to help you get started with a free HR audit. All you have to do is go to Bambi.com slash duck right now. It'll schedule your free HR audit. That's Bambi.com slash duck spelled BAM to the B-E-E dot com slash duck. Well, Willie, hey, he's like that Airedale dog. He ain't as dumb as he looks. There's a lot more to run this business than I thought. Well, yeah. With That's you, why we, I do it. Well, hey, with you, we need an HR department. There you go, boys. All right, well, we're back. All right, we're back, boys. And um, that got weird in the break, just so everybody's aware. We got so off track that yeah, I well, don't even know. Do we go back to movies? Do we try to get back on track, or do or we do just we follow this tips? trail to where it goes? Hunt, I like hunting tips, like Fabrice's biz, bizarre hunting tips. Right, do I, just, got, I do have a hunting tip for y'all. Okay. So, do you hunt? Yeah, I hunt. Just ask him a question. Uh, no, no, I'm pretty he good. He hunts at it. Okay. I hunt at it, but <laughs> but I was fishing with two of my friends, and it wasn't si. It's a hunting and tip, and it wasn't so I was stone. fishing. A hunting tip hunting means and going fishing. fishing. Hunting okay. and fishing. Okay, all right. Yeah. Every good hunting tip starts with, so me and my buddies were fishing. Yeah, we were fishing. Yeah. <laughs> and don't ever fish with three people in a small boat, because when he threw his lure, it hooked underneath my eyelid, and we had to. So he got a big one. He got a big one, but yeah. he didn't hit the eyeball. He just hit the eyelid. Oh, okay. And I thought, but I thought he had the, he was like my eye was gone. But yeah, be careful hunting, fishing out of a boat that's small with three people. Yeah. Like us four would need a big pro boat to tip. fish out of. Yeah. yeah that's well. your, that's your pro, t- uh-oh. Why do you have Cut him. Eye? Cut him, oh. Si. Cut him for You something. got that one. Okay. Yeah. Si just that's a Tom, true story. It's Tommy Topper over here, okay? Tommy Topper. Ta- ta- yeah. Time out. Why are you wielding a blade right now? Yeah, so for our listeners. It, it comes with a story that I'm fixing to tell. He oh, just so we got a knife. Is we that the sh- knife you lost yeah. no. for two years in your no. truck? No. I, I, I was just going to look son. at it and tell people about it. I, Don't raise razor sharp. Hey, y'all become blood All brothers right here. All I got to right do is Nicky. Nope. But anyway, Phil is fishing with Nick Jimmy. Jimmy McGuire. Oh, Jimmy Mac. Oh, in, Mr. and Miss McGuire's in, boy. I'm hey, going, in oh, high school. I, I know, in high school, right? I know, I, know, I know this story. No, no, look. <laughs> this was good here. He's got a devil horse on his deal, topwater, okay? And he goes like this back. He hooks McGuire, I think, right here on the hand. Yeah. I mean, hey, the, the, barb, the barb has gone through, okay? So an intelligent person, okay? Would take a pair of wire, a pair, not pie, a, a pair. Take like that pair and yeah. do something you're with it. A pair. Like now, you would pole take pole. a pair of wire cutters, okay, and where the hook is through past the barb, you would go behind it and cut it and then just slide it out. A normal person. Yeah, now look. Something, that, something very similar to this, yeah. right? Throw no, that no. over here for a minute. Throw I, it at JD. I, no, Put, no. Catch him in the beard. No, no, because I need, I need to, I know. To, to make this you know what? look I, right. Hook. Hook John David so you can show us the okay. story. Yeah. Right. You ready? Yes. Yeah. 
Oh, it's in a package. Hook him, hook him and show us. The, the package was going to open. Put your hand down flat, J.D. Going to hey. open, so I can't even open. That's a good open point. It, it wasn't going to open. open. That's a good clamshell. You got to okay. spend some money on packaging. Uh, here. Uh, here, let me have your hand. <laughs> Get back in your mic. Look. There you go. Okay. Sorry, I, I see, wasn't paying attention to it. You probably can't see the bar, but anyway, it's, his, his skin is hooked here. It's right here. So, <laughs> Phil... Take the pocket knife, just like it's right here, right as a shark, and he grabs the bait and pulls it up. Well, the skin is like this, and then he takes the pocket knife and just, just, poof. On the skin? But how did he say it? This is my favorite part of it. He said, he said, I know I said it because I've heard this story. He said, Jimmy, now look, here, I can get that out for you. He said, can you? So yeah, here's all you do. He said you pull it real tight, and you, know, you, you make like a mountain, right? That's you, right. Yeah. See, it looks like he said it looks like a mountain, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. So he's getting him distracted by talking yeah. to him. Then all of a sudden, Phil says, and then he cut off the top of the mountain, <laughs> and then he just hits that piece of skin. It's gone. He's got skin on his hook, no. and he's bleeding. It feels like hey. oh yeah, just rub a little dirt on it. It'd be all right. Hundred <laughs> percent true story. Hey, that's true. That's why I don't put fit. that back in there. <laughs> okay, sorry. Don't hey, me. look. The only thing I look. Jimmy McGuire is literally bleeding to death. <laughs> Cause look, he he cut a piece of skin the size of a nickel. Yeah, he cut a plug off of he it. He cut the top of that, that mountain off. Yeah. But yeah it so, was, hey, when you're fishing with sanitary. Robertson, with Phil Robertson, if you ever get hooked, don't let him touch you. Terrible that's terrible. Uh, oh, my goodness. <laughs> but, look, that is that is – yeah, I mean, I got another hunting story. There's a lot of, uh, oh, there's a lot. So, if we're doing tips and tricks, there's a lot of videos also on YouTube. <laughs> Just get you some braided line and pull the hook out. You don't have to cut the top of the mountain off. I, I highly yeah. recommend that method. Yeah, versus, that's, one, that's, that's one way to do this it. This is yeah. one of them things. Do not do this yeah. at home. This one, this tip, that tip right there falls under the category of, uh, that that tip is a don't do instead thought, of a do. You don't want to do this. Yeah. Our other ones were do's. That one's a don't do. Hey, so. not only have we fell off the train track, it was going over a trestle, and we fell in the river. Well, okay. Well, now we're in the river, boys. Well, we back and now we're treading water, boys. We are treading water. While we're treading, let's go ahead and take our next break. Why don't we? Let's like tread a, on that. That sounds like a winner to me. He got one. Hey, quit shaking that. I thought she was going to pistol whoop John David for us. Me and Martin done paid you. I need you. to do that. I'm going to save that for the we last. We paid you last time to do it, and you didn't do it. No, we're going to do that the last episode of the podcast. <laughs> that might like, be today. Like the next one? I'm gonna, no. I'm oh. going to pull a, I'm gonna pull a Marshall Dillon, and I'm going to pistol whip. He's, you already got him scared. Uh, All right. Uh, Johnny D, look, here's the deal. I know this This. It's been a kind of a tumultuous sports week for you. Your, your hero hung up his spikes, man. What? I see you're still wearing that. I see you're wearing that Saints jersey or sweatshirt. Is, are you in mourning? Like, is oh. that is that what we're hey, at? You used the word there. Give me the definition of it. Re pronounce it again and give me the definition. Mourning no. to be depressed. The, sad. the hero? You said the T. You tumultuous. Said about tumultuous? <laughs> yeah. Tumultuous. That yeah. would that would be that Sorry. would be an accurate word to describe yesterday's weather. Yeah, Sai, you need to start using that word. Tumultuous. tumultuous. Oh, it's on. Um, I can't hey, I wait. I thought he was making some kind of I can't lemonade, wait. squeezing lemons or something. Tumultuous. Yeah. Mmm, mmm. This is tumultuous, right. boy. Oh. Well, well, how do you feel anyway. about how do you feel about Drew retiring, <laughs> Mr. Drew Brees? What? How do you feel about Mr. that? Brees. I'm curious. I. This is. Thank you, Sai. I know. Size, size, giving John traumatic. David a hug. This is yeah. traumatic. I know you need a hug. Thank you. You're welcome. No, Drew Brees is a man. Uh, <laughs> he provided us in Louisiana a lot of good times no, and won a national championship. Well, Super Bowl is what they call it, and the Super Bowl. Oh, hey, um, hey. Drew. <laughs> now that entertainment center he built up the road. Hey, Drew, can you send me a gift card or something? Because good night, that thing's expensive. Yeah. But uh, no, Drew Brees was a man for. 15 years. Yeah. I know. was 15 when Drew Brees signed on with the Saints, or 16. So, what and I... And, yeah, it's, I'm sad. It's the end of a great era. 
If anyone ever talks bad about Drew Brees, I will punch you square in the nose. No, <laughs> um, no Ooh, Drew's awesome. So watch out. You rubbing off on him. So, yeah, I know. <laughs> I'll, start, I'll start pistol whipping people with Sai for oh, bad mouth and Drew Brees. He's going to learn how to pistol whip from Sai. <laughs> no, nah, because Drew Brees, is, he's more than like a quarterback. He's done so much for our state and just everything him and his wife do. He's just a great person. He seems to be a pretty good Is he going to move here? <laughs> to West Monroe? Yeah. Why? He's well, moving, hey, I that thought he's moving to house San here. Diego. He got a house here? No. That's what I thought. Sign those things that y'all don't know. Well, no, no. I thought he really did have a house up here in West Monroe. For, I mean, he built a big, uh, for what? like, what, a vacation uh, home? Tumultuous like, place. He's got a yeah, restaurant. A tumultuous place over there, okay? He has no idea what that word <laughs> yeah, means, and it's fantastic. Well, I told you that's why I asked you a while ago. What did oh, you say, Oh, he's going to wear it out. I told you it's an accurate description of yesterday's weather. Si going to yes, get sir. his tumultuous. What has that got to do with Drew Brees? Tell him, Si. I have no idea where we're going with he this. He just had a rough week. I mean, Drew when, Brees oh, is retiring. When you are a Saints. Yeah, but if it had to do with weather, what has Drew Brees retiring got to do with weather? It's tumultuous. I give up. Is he a cause of it? <laughs> I'm just trying to. I don't know. I, <laughs> uh, hey, I don't know then don't talking. use that stupid word. <laughs> Bunch of idiots. Right. It, seems that, right. it seems that right. size I'm gonna have epistemology to, is obfuscated. Right. But here's the thing. <laughs> I wish you, you well, Mr. Drew Brees, okay, because you did entertain us on the football field. He did. I right. bet Kay's here, heartbroken. Here. Too. Me and Miss oh, Kay no. are two of the Oh, I, I, had to, I had to check on her about that. Yeah, she's probably to, heartbroken. We That's need right. to call Kay and make That's sure right. she's okay. Because yeah. Kay uh, is the second biggest Saints fan I know yeah. behind John yeah. Davis. Me and Miss Kay, we yeah, talk football had, all the time. She had one of those, <laughs> JD. That's uh, rough. Been rough today. Right. I, what did y'all right. feed him? I, did that roast beef sandwich do that? No, no. You don't understand. I'm going in my second childhood. You're starting over? Yeah, I'm thinking I'll punch you in the mouth. <laughs> they they can't get along. Okay. Now they can't get along. Right, I'm right. trying to help you because, uh, first uh, off, well, hey, help me. Drew Brees, thank you. We love you. That's it. We hope right. you the best of luck That's in right. your retirement. Good retirement. Life. And keep doing all the good work you're doing with all that money you make from right. football and that restaurant and arcade. And arcade. <laughs> and that hard you got me on that one, Drew. Uh, 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 but no, I was there, and I literally looked at my wife. We do like, wish oh. you well, I said. Drew Brees made enough money off me in my life. I'm out of this arcade. But I, do, I but want I to know. Look, I want to know one thing though. Don't. Who is the next quarterback of the New Orleans Saints? Who Who's your guy? Like, where Where do you want to see this thing? What are go? the choices? I'm just curious. What are the choices? The The world's your oyster. So, the, but there's really no, only a couple. There's two choices. Yeah. I'm going to say I want Taysom Hill to be the quarterback of the New Orleans Saints. Taysom Hill is the greatest football player on earth. Yeah, okay. he's great. He's, no, he's the. I don't know if you want to trap him in a quarterback he play position. For now? He's the great. He who? plays for the Saints. He's oh. the greatest football player on earth. Okay. Left tackle, fullback, tight end, quarterback, he receiver, yeah. wide special receiver, team. Special, teams, special teams, kicker, team, kicker, punter, right. hey. linebacker. I Tom Brady can't that. do that. Drop kick. Yeah. Tom Brady cannot do that. No. He can play quarterback, but he can't play he can defensive end. He can win a Super Bowl. Hey, y'all lock it up. All right. All right. Way to go, Drew. All right, here you go. We got one. All right, good job, Drew Brees. But, hey, here's the deal. I looked up the definition of tumultuous. Oh, here we go. Right, give it to me. Slowly now. Slowly. Ma making a loud, confused noise, uproarious. There we go. Excited, Up confused, or disorderly. There you go. Hey. Hey, the that's exact the, description of yesterday's weather. That's it. Or Sai. Or Sai's childhood. <laughs> oh, that's traumatization. Oh. His first childhood or his second childhood? His second's starting a lot better than his first, I think. It's the first time he's, he's ever been He's finna kill somebody. Silent. Look at that. Look, that's the icy stare. That's right. We've heard tell that's about right. the icy stare. I've had goats fall over just dead. <laughs> and shake. Mm. Shake and die. <laughs> hey, Sai, please tell Martin. I know we're going in a different direction, but please tell Martin about you and your buddy going and looking at the helicopters involved and, and when you're in, in Vietnam saying, let's do something different. Oh, no, no. We wasn't looking at helicopters. Because uh, you got your Vietnam hat on and we that's was, made uh, me think of I it. think we've discussed this before. Uh, we was about half drunk. Oh, I didn't and, know that. Know, and, well, here uh, we go. That's the most. And we we had got bored, okay, and we uh, was going to volunteer to be a chopper door gunner. And the life expectancy. Oh, you told this. oh yeah, know. we know this one. Yeah, yeah. He told the life expectancy the was seventy-two hours. They've done heard this. Yeah. Sorry, we're repeating ourselves there. 
fans. Can't all, help it. All it took us 18 weeks. The hat right. gave it away. <laughs> Before Cy started running back NOM stories. Right. We do get a lot That's of requests for NOM stories. That's called a Cy back flashback. Right. But, yeah, you Brought said to you you're going to do it because you – Cause you were half drunk, you were gonna that's go right. be yeah. a. Yeah, but Martin had brought that up. What's this half drunk? You ain't yeah. never. And I said, that's well, exactly okay, right. okay. The honesty is, we was polluted. Yeah, okay. <laughs> we drunk. Okay, we was drunk. I've been a lot okay. of. I, look, <laughs> look. I've had a colorful past too. I've been a lot of things in my life. I've never been half drunk. Yeah. This is I'm not either, like I'm either sober. <laughs> <laughs> or I'm drunk. There's one thing that there ain't no halfway yeah, this point. This is on. not like a gas tank that you look at a, 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 a meter and say, "Yeah, I'm half drunk yeah. right now." No, there's no gray area. <laughs> you're either sober yeah. or plowed. I mean, that's where you're at. Yeah, plowed. So. That's tomorrow. I like <laughs> plowed. I like that. Yeah. <laughs> I, I'll have to use that from now. Half hey, plowed. Once when I was plowed. <laughs> Back in my tumultuous years. <laughs> hey, oh, you know, man. Once, what a word. Once when I was about. hooked to the mule and I was plowed. <laughs> Guaranteed. Yeah. Hooked to the mule. <laughs> Guaranteed. Yeah. JD, yeah. what has the fans been up to? Defiance. Well, we yeah. gonna we gonna get there in just a minute. Oh, are we? Okay, yeah, we are gonna get there. I'm rushing things. Folks. You are. Sorry about you that. Are he's ready to go things. home. Yeah, he's he, we'll be all right. But so I, mean, I got a poker game waiting on him. I will say that you know I looked through a lot of the comments last week on our fan show since it was the Tuesday when I read through a lot of it, and I'm actually stunned at how many people didn't know I was bald on top. I didn't wear a hat because yeah, that's I good. mean I really don't care. But look. For spoiler alert, I'm 35 now. <laughs> I've been balding since I was 20. So I mean, well, like I, this, this ain't new. I just didn't wear a hat. Si, but you got I, more than Mark. Well, you ain't by yourself, si, there, youngster. So si, Hammer, you're 72. <laughs> yeah, like <laughs> oh, you're look, you're double si. me. Well, I know. So si, everything's going south in this body. Okay? Yeah. Well, no. now 100%. No. The hair's first time. falling out. The teeth are starting to fall out or being You're, pulled. My teeth fall out all the yeah, time. I still got all them. I still got all them. Tooth but, out the man, day. when your chopper start falling but, out, boy. But my hair has had quit in it since I was 20. So, I had the first know. time I met Martin, That's hereditary. I it thought is. you Your were, dad was like that, wasn't he? My dad, my grandparents. Oh. I'm, I'm surrounded by baldness. Okay, my baldness. Like, yeah. Like, I'll be well, good hey, soon, here's but I'll the deal. always have hair. Baldness is cool. I agree. I No, no, I'm serious. And look. Hey, here's the deal. So you being tumultuous. All, no, 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 no. All people, okay, only a selected few look good with bald hair. Telly Savalas. Do y'all know who that is? Yep. yep. Hey, the you man. You know, Martin? Mm -hmm. Telly Savalas, the man. Look, John David don't know who Telly Savalas hey, is. 100% I do. That was the last cool ball headed uh, guy. Uh, oh, oh except that, for Godwin. Hey, and then oh, oh, that, yeah, Godwin. Yeah, <laughs> what about that, Sorry, John? <laughs> Telly Savalas uses the word cool a lot. Yep. Yeah. You're Telly cool, Savalas. And he had this and he had cool the little out, sucker. Baby. But you're baby, right though. Baldness baby. is cool. No, no. I but I legitimately thought you were fifteen years older than me right. when we first met. Oh, I get that all the time. I thought you were like Willie's <laughs> age. Yeah, That's an IQ. And then I found out no, he's about three years older than me. Yeah, I get that all I had an E six that was in charge of me, okay? Every time I seen that man, you know, one woman wasn't enough. Okay, and as fine as she was, he always had one on each arm. You reckon no. that's because he's bald? Was that Big hey, Oaf? Baldness is in, boy. No, hey. No, Big Oaf. No, Big stacked, Oaf had hair. Big Oaf could have stacked about seven of them on top hey. of him, as way Cy si tells, as hey. big as he was. No, no, look, you got to understand <laughs> something. You know, I mean, this guy is 450 pounds, 6'6. Six, six, and his head, you ain't big headed, okay? Because I could take a bath in his Smokey the Bear hat. Oh, man, I love it. Hey, hey, but I, I, I had to respect the guy, though, okay? Because on Fort Bend in Georgia, you run everywhere you go. No walking. And so did Big O. And so did Big O, boys. Big O. Uh, we're back on Big O. Forget it. Big listen, o. In case y'all didn't listen last week. <laughs> hey, back on Big O. Hey. Big oh, my o. goodness gracious. Hey, there's enough. You know, hey, I want that, you to keep expounding on how baldness is cool, though, because that makes me feel. Well, no, no, bad. it is. Okay. And I'm. I'm, I'm, I'm Howie Mandel. Uh, no, no. Howie Mandel. Cool. Uh, Howie I mean, Mandel. Right, time out. Time out. Please don't use Howie Mandel in the defense of my baldness. I, I'm like, trying to. Okay. Please. The discussion is. All right, is baldness cool? I'm throwing some names out there. Right, nice. Here's yeah. no, but Who's he's the not guy? Cool. He was on Dancing. Uh, 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 yeah. Dancing. What? No. What's that new new one where they they dance and they got masks on? Mask. The, uh, tumultuous dancer. No mask. 
The Mass Dancer. Singer, mass dancer. The Mass, mass dancer. dancer. Yeah, I don't watch okay. any of that. He watched the Mass Dancer. And, and he, he was, yeah. He's got, Look, basic he ca- he's got basic cable hey, plus he's, seven he's channels. He's only bro. got like right. eight channels. Hey, he got, he, you he only had two. Y'all got to tell me who he is. He won the, dan- the Mass Dancer. Okay. I have no idea. I don't watch that. Was he bald? Hey, and also he was uh, uh, replaced Bob Barker on Price is Right. Drew Carey. Yeah. That's, he's that's, not bald. He no, is bald. He's got a flat top. Oh, no, he's, he's got, like got a, a flat top. He's bald. Drew Carey just gets Side, a that's because your TV's so fuzzy. You, he looks no, bald. Hey, oh. Oh, look, he's hey, good. he's not bald. He's bald. Yeah, he I'm is. showing no, you a picture right now. I don't now. think he is. 100% not, not bald. Not the white guy. This guy I'm talking about is black. Wayne Brady, thank you. Wayne Brady. Well, that's not. Bald headed. That's not Price is Right. Yeah, he is. He si, does it. Si, no, let's make a deal. It's let's make oh, a deal. Well, let's hey, make a deal, Sam. It's the same thing. <laughs> same. It's let's the make same a deal. thing. <laughs> <laughs> and you're one of seven people well, that hey, have look, time every day hey, to watch Let's Make a Deal. Hey, it comes no, no, no. Hey, we're talking about who's cool. Deal maker. Ball. Wayne Ball. Brady. Wayne Brady's hilarious. Oh, hey, that's I the one. one. That's the one. I, and cool he's good looking. And he's not bald. But you know who else is cool? He's I cool. guess he's, oh, he's bald. bald. You know he's who bald. else? He's bald now. Time yeah, out. Bald. You know who else is cool and bald? Scott, who? Scott Van Pelt. He's pretty awesome. He's all right. Don't know him. Uh, <laughs> you don't know ESPN. You don't know SVP? I like Scott Van Pelt. I made, hey, I made no I'm a big I fan. Him. I'm a big fan of Van Pelt. Got uh, to he, hang out with him back during the dynasty Martin. days. Super cool fella. Oh, you super keep, cool You boy, keep right. thinking right. that Sai's got unlimited resources for, for a cable channels no that's john david thing of that i know uh, what he's got on tv he's, he's got, got like eight channels. channels he called me up hey you getting the national championship over your place I oh said, no no yeah. no he hey said, look come get me i keep telling y'all that redhead i'm married to is me yeah she slashed gonna... my tv just down oh, yeah. to nothing i'm backing okay. you up on that too well as hey. loud as you listen to daryl's garage i would too well hey Golly. He, you know, that hey, surprises me. Don't but think bad about Daryl. He, he I'm not talking bad about Daryl. Si Daryl loves Hall and Oates. Hey, hey, everybody hey, loves Hall hey, does, does everybody know about the Hall and Oates hotline? Do y'all know about that, I don't John Davis? I know, I know yes. it's Daryl's house. So listen to this. So there's a number here. I'm going to give it out 719 266 2837. Hall and Oates hotline. So you call it and it's like. You have reached the Hall and Oates hotline. To hear one on one, press one. To hear, and then you got why four the songs. Why is the British accent? Is is Daryl Brit? I, I don't know. Do you want to hear it? Si, let me pl- I'm going to play no, it. No, I don't want to hear it. I'm going to do it. I don't want to hear it, I said. I know. That's why I'm doing it. Welcome to Hall and Oates, your emergency Hall and Oates helpline. Listen. To hear one on one, please press one to hear it go. I said I didn't want to hear it. Ooh, I want to listen to Rich Girl. Yeah. I was going to play it, but Sal si was going to shoot me. That's right. I was going to shoot him. But you do like Daryl Hall. I do. That bad at the bone. Sal, si, sing your Darryl. favorite Daryl Hall song for us. I can't. Oh. Mm. Okay. We've done lost it. <laughs> We've done lost it. Sal si totally. pulled a gun. We've done lost it. Totally. I want to take a break, but I feel like the last four minutes we've been on break, so I'm not real sure. Yeah. I wish I had some bullets. I'm glad. I'm glad he knows. Hey, with the mood I'm in right now and these lights, <laughs> he's sick of these lights. Hey. Johnny D, hey. he's seeing the spots. Take us to break, please, Johnny hey. D. Please, Johnny D. Oh. Give us an email. Let's hey. let's get back on track here. Give us an email. Are we let's... taking a break first? Yeah, we might as well. I just Are figured we I figured we were going to call part of that so we oh, could put the totally break in there. Are. I apologize, folks. That we're is, taking a break. Yeah. Heavily edited <laughs> section. Yeah. Whatever you're watching right now break. was chopped up, moved around. I moved around. It got I'm weird. Like, I give up. All right. Break. Last All right. and final break for today. We'll come back and we'll talk about some emails and we're going to close with our Bible verse and our editing crew who's listening to this yeah. right now, be sure not their cut it work, off this week. Have got so their work cut out for them. This for all week. of you that raised that concern, that was actually a glitch with YouTube. We would never cut off a verse mid-stroke. So there you go. And all there, right, we'll be right back. I need a real break. And there are no bullets in the gun. Or midstream. All right, here we go. We are back with the fan section of the week johnny d what is in our hello h-e-l-l-o at duckcallroom.com inbox oh we got some inbox okay well, is it full oh it's full it's bursting over. it's over for well so last week we i think it was a tuesday episode we asked who would play uncle si in oh. a movie mm-hmm. it's thought it'd be uncle interesting si. do you have any robert redford 
Do you have any Robert living? Robert Redford? Oh, yeah. living. That yeah. was I was just going to say, Sa- that would take a lot of makeup. Mm. And I came up with the guy from Back to the Future. I can't remember his name ever. He played in Taxi. With the crazy hair? Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, he yeah. played Brown. in Taxi. Dr. Brown. Hi. No, what's his real name, oh. though? Christopher Lloyd. Christopher, yep. Lloyd. Christopher yep. Lloyd. That's we him, We got boys. a couple people that agree with that. That's good. Yeah. That's a good choice. We got a couple Johnny Depps. Mm. Oh, he Johnny Depp could he, pull it off. He's a good actor, but I guess makeup could make it with him. <laughs> we got a couple. I like. I like. I like Christopher Lloyd. I still like. We, I still got a whole list. Oh, a list. Gary okay. Busey. Oh. Oh, crazy Gary. Yeah. Yeah. The yeah good Gary? answer. Well, in that case, let me throw Charlie Sheen into the mix too. Oh, the no. picture, the picture of the one y'all just said don't come up. I know Charlie Sheen. You don't know who Gary Busey is? No. Hey, show him who's, the arrest who's, picture. Who's Busey? The arrest picture oh, of Gary, Gary Busey. Gary Busey, <laughs> uh, mugshot. Oh, who's the guy off of four? That's Gary hours. Busey. You don't think Gary Busey could play you? Oh, he could pull it off. Okay, John <laughs> David. <laughs> That's yeah, just yeah, Google Gary image Busey, search. Gary Busey Gary could Busey. pull it off, boy. John David. Who, he ain't gonna need much makeup. In, 48 hours with uh, Eddie Murphy. What was the guy's name, the white guy? No, Eddie Murphy's out. <laughs> yeah, but the donkey. Nick ain't. Nolte. No, Nick what? Nolte. Yeah, look at his arrest picture. Well, how could, do you, what are, the, are you on some, like, website where you look at celebrity yeah. uh, mug shots? I got it right here. Yes, it's called TMZ. Oh, uh, yeah. That dude could play you, so. Nolte, oh, yeah. man. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, he could play me. So we also have hey, that's four or five Steve Buscemi. He could yeah. do it. Yeah. And my personal favorite, uh, Gandalf from Lord of the Rings. <laughs> Somebody, like, we got two or three of those. <laughs> Stop. Pick really? up that stick and slam it down and say, thou shalt not pass. No, that, no. A couple people sent in Gandalf, including Chris from Florida. He said, Uncle Si, Gandalf, Lord of the Rings. That's all he said in the email. Yeah. What does he look like? <laughs> what does Gandalf Chris. look yeah. like? Hold on. Well, We're having hey, to do a lot hey, of Google searching saying, today. Y'all are saying names in the hate. It ain't the picture ain't coming. Oh, he could put it off too. I, was thinking, I just typed in Gandalf. Right, he's got the beard. Okay, what he about put it off. Granny Hawkins had a little beard. Hey, Granny Hawkins. Oh lord, she don't like Jayhawkers. <laughs> oh lord. <laughs> uh, and then last week we also had a very extensive discussion on is a hot dog a sandwich. Philip, do you want to chime in on that? I would say no. Right. You'd say no. Martin's the only one hanging up with yes. But I, but, will, I but, read a bunch of comments on that one, too. And everybody now right. is saying is a hot dog is a taco. That That right. is the email I got. You got Have three no's. Have you thought it being a You got taco. three no's, so you're not going to Hollywood. But which one? <laughs> but I, when you say, I, and I'm not going to go too far because we had like 10 minutes on this. You'll but, never dance in that's Hollywood. Right, that's right. Phil, <laughs> Philip got it when I said three no's and you're not going to Hollywood. Okay, anyway, okay, back, on, two back, on, they ain't left him. back on hot dogs and tacos. <laughs> How do you know which one came first, the hot dog or the taco? Like It's like the chicken and the egg deal. So, like, are, is a hot dog, in fact, a taco, or is a taco, in fact, a hot dog? Well, we know chickens came first because God made the animals. Bing, 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 bing. I understand. We're talking about the philosophical argument here. Oh. Anyway, I'm going with the hot right. dogs a taco from now on. Hot Next dog is a taco. From hot, my good friend drink. Mason from old Jasper, Alabama, is a Slim Jim beef jerky? No. Yes. It is no. a meat stick. No. That's a meat stick, definitely, <laughs> not beef jerky. It's a meat stick. It's it not jerky. They are correct on it. It's a meat stick, boys. Now, Slim Sorry, Jim John started David. making jerky, but the original no. is a stick. And it's that delicious. That you pop. I didn't say it Oh, it is good. delicious. I agree. Some of them ain't bad. I didn't say it wasn't good. Jerky meat stick. That's right. It's a meat stick. Well, now I'm offended. But yes. Meat. uh, So we're just, that was that easy (laughs) for y'all? Yeah, I don't it's not beef jerky. Nah. No. Beef jerky. No. Man, I really thought that one was gonna. No, I would call. I would call Slim Jim sausage before I called it beef jerky. Yeah, that's true. You would call it sausage. Ding, 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 man! Give that man a point. Yeah. All right. I would. Shape's all wrong. Whatever. Beef jerky's flat. Yeah. So and tough. So here yeah. we go. Here's the last one. We've apparently become like the snack kings of the internet. Uh oh. I agree with that. <laughs> the snack kings of the internet. We've had Reese's sit in. Kings. We've and it's all been stuff we've asked for. Well, my girl Katrina from North Dakota. Oh, she was fired. From the Dakotas, boys. The northern one. Yeah. Yeah. 
she sent a box. Katrina was fired. Of North Dakota goodies. If you worked here more, Philip, you would have got some. Yeah, we done. They do- gone. We done dope popped them dots pretzels. She, she oh, sent, I didn't even get none of them. No, there was only one bag. More. Oh, yeah. Cy got you weeded thought, out. You thought it pitiful. Yeah. Well, you, there's some. There's. I think there's some of one maybe bag or two left. But oh. that original but recipe is. Was fine. it good? And, oh, and oh, it's so good. And there's a bottle of Miss T's. Spicy yeah. Oh yeah, we got that for you. Wow. Mister and Mrs. Right. T's. I just paid Mr. Ty hundred right. bucks for getting it wrong. Right. That's true. Uh, so Katrina, thank you for sending the snacks. And if you want our opinion on Dot's pretzels. <sighs> So good. The original are fire. They're, they're very ri- good. The Southwest, yeah, it's good. They're okay. The, the original, original is fire. Miss Dot. Miss so Dot. They're, they're hot. No, they're just great. And there's some chocolates oh, and stuff in there, too, that were good. But. When you're hot, you're hot. When you're not, you're not. Jerry Reed. But, uh, <laughs> okay, boys. Okay, boys. <laughs> Boy, this on is, that note. Yeah, this on is, that note. This has been a week. Hey. Philip. Bring us home. That's right. I do have a Bible verse for us. Um, this is coming from Hebrews eleven six, and without faith it is impossible to please God, because anyone who comes to Him must believe that He exists, and that He rewards those who earnestly seek Him. That was an excellent verse, sir. Thank you. Yep. So do you need me to define earnestly, or are you good on that one? No, oh, he's good. got that one. Right. Thumbs up on that one, boys. All right, well, we're out. We hope that you guys do not have a tumultuous week. What? Uh, what? We'll, they we'll nailed it, Si. We'll see y'all si. Thursday on the Duck Call Room. <laughs> we're out. <laughs> <laughs> now, I get the last word this week. <laughs>